I think if they're if they haven't taken this game within about 20 30 minutes if they don't have all the towers and have full control of this game they're going to be in some really deep trouble later on it's uh it's a tough way for secret to play but very happy with the situation because they're up against the chen and if the chen doesn't provide his team oh oh maybe this is the opening they needed they do catch up pilot i bring him down somehow some way this could transition oh, into a lot of yes. power pressure and he's got the right creeps for it too there's the troll trap to start the stop could likely follow he gets off the monolith but the hadouken the test of fate art style make it two to zero and that was otherwise it's going to be difficult for them to actually get get a tower here because secret has a lot of deep push it's going to be another go on rtz he really doesn't want to have to use that time walk but test of faith now that the damage comes out he will uh oh the stop ambush connects on two heroes rtz though is very slow because of the boar he does manage to get the ultimate off combining with puppy but art style tanking his own right he's going to turn this one the creeps are swarming onto puppy they bring him down and suddenly the whole navi host descends upon secret rtz down to the south though is healthy survives through it all and now envy moves in angry out for vengeance the boy time walks away rtz escapes envy survives and navi give chase dendy can he bring down rtz this will be a huge kill but he time walks back doesn't heal himself in doing so, but he survives. And meanwhile, Arteezy oh, continuing to run while Envy cleaning up. He's gotten a triple kill, looking for more. Can he make it an ultra? Dendy will chain away. Still the pursuit. Envy's fast. Just needs one, maybe two more auto attacks to finish this one off, but almost stubborn about it. I mean, it. if they don't kill him first before the fight starts, they go, for, go on his teammates. He's just going to drop the chrono on the rest of the heroes coming in. So they kind of have to focus him to try and bring, bring him down before he drops chrono. The bashes are stacking up here for Arteezy, but the swap from Seneca will save the day. The problem is is they can't really go he's on this so face of point. He's just hitting Seneco now instead. He's almost brought two heroes down essentially by himself and there with one more auto attack, Arteezy will get the job done. They just don't seem to have the damage. Can they at least kill Envy who is probably the bigger damage at the stage? They'll bring him down. Then Arteezy starts to whack away at Art Style. Brings him down to half HP. Bulba is here. Meanwhile has the lasso. Gonna drag Dendi back. They'll look to focus the timber saw with the arrow splitter coming through as well. He gets pushed back into Ooh. it by a beautiful flame break by Bulba. Secret just keep on connecting and now the best Dash on Dayar as well. One more could put him into harm's way. Although Puppy is a bit low on the mana. Doesn't have the echo stop combo. Well, they'll finally claim this tier one mid. Can't believe it's still standing with a Chen, Beastmaster, and Venge on the Navi side. Ooh, the air splitter coming. comes through. The swap out, trying to keep General alive, and the stun forward from Seneco. The Bulba wrangles him even deeper, pulling General out of position a bit further. They'll get the kill there. They're fighting without the Chrono. Now they've got it available. Arteezy laying into Seneco. Even when Navi find their opening, they kill the Razor. They still give up two heroes. Oh, Roshan would be very dangerous against Elder Titan. Navi are they're saying, come at us, Secret. We've had some miraculous fights around the pit so far this event. Let's roll the dice again. The swarm onto Arteezy, setting things up here, but again, Puppy will be prepared with the Echo Stomp, trying to make sure he gets that spirit on every single hero. Then back into the pit, it will go, and meanwhile, a lasso grab to the south. They've found Seneco. There won't be a swap counter play, obviously, as the bench gets caught out. Will be brought down. Radiant, though, do get the Roshan, the last hit as well. The Age is going to take Yara, and then the real fight breaks out. General on the run, getting surrounded by Secret, pounded, brought down, and now turning back for Dendi with Arteezy there on the chase. Bulba in pursuit. They are out of ultimates, and Proper lockdown, but a bash from Arteezy may be enough. Bulba can try to slow him with the sticky. But Dendi says that's sticky, and he just keeps on going. Looks like he should be okay, though. So they continue chasing. Maybe not yet. Uh, he has a Secret going deep for this one. Envy getting the damage stolen, and now Dendi going to turn the other direction, but oh, there they go. They managed to disable the cooldown on the timber chain. It has to Bloodstone deny, so Dendi falls in the end. Bat ride. you also have the spirit always scouting is the other thing, and you really, it doesn't seem like they can burst the void. Or the, the Razor now at the BKB, so it's just, it's very tough to get that kill. And, well, for Secret, the kills seem to be a little bit easier. They're moving on to Dendi now. The lasso comes through. Will he get the Bloodstone deny off? Not going to happen. Deleted. Bat Rider with, uh, with the recall as well. Oh, Chrono onto Dendi. kills. Arteezy going to work here. Gets off the dilation as well. Dendi as well as, you know, not too much greed. Yeah, I and think... things like the Vanguard are, are kind of finding that balance, but here comes the smoke from Navi, looking for the opening here, the swap under Arteezy. He mantles quickly, the bench stun, not going to be there in time. He jumps out. Had plenty of time to react to that one. They don't have that swap in the hex type of combo. And now Secret looking to turn this one around on its head. Dayara getting pulled back. The Chen Han of God not enough. There's the Chrono on the Art Style logging Seneco down too. And Arteezy surges forward. The creep army's here for now. Art Style completely held down. The Weaver dead. Arteezy actually going to back away and play it safe because the Timber Saw is in far. Dendi looks like his going to be his turn next. Flame Break back in. Will not get off the Bloodstone deny. Now down to a lonely three charges.
Like, he's definitely feeling the effects of the Elder Titan stomp plus the mana leak. And if he ever gets caught by a Chrono and there's not a Venge swap, he's just done for. Oh. Zarteezy is gonna calmly man to dodge a Venge stun. Just keeps on moving forward. He may look for the Chrono here momentarily. No, he's gonna zippity doo dah right out of there instead. Going in deep is General, and they're gonna immediately focus that Beastmaster down. Axes get lobbed out. He will fall as well. Dendi going deep for this one, but Arteezy is on the case. Moving for Dendi and gets the stomp off, follows it up with some auto attacks, finishes the job, gets the kill. Two cores down, Arteezy at full HP, just healing time walk after time walk. The damage is just shaken off with these as he moves forward deeper. Is starting to get a bit low. We'll time walk that off as well. Stomp coming through, just barely failing to clip Diyara, but the napalm prevents him from turning easily. Secret, a three for one there, and now looking for more. I think I'm most impressed with the way they itemize this game and the way they approach the game. That was, I think, by far the biggest deal that made Na'Vi struggle so much in this game. Oh, Diyara trying to hit Envy and quickly finds that Envy hits back a lot harder. Arteezy will bring that melee rex down. He does get swapped in into a roar. Do they have the refresher or it doesn't look like it? Can they focus him down or is he going to time walk it all off? Oh no, he's out of there and now General gets pulled back in. Na'Vi just don't have the firepower required. The purge comes through. Dityara committing for Arteezy. He just can't scratch him. The man's too tanky. They, they can't kill Arteezy without is... a huge overcommitment or the refresher and I don't know that they're going to get a chance to farm it now with the Illuminate coming through. Seeker could maybe chase for more kills. They have the Chrono again, but they that don't feel the need to force it. So disheartening, failing to kill the Void there. He's just way too tanky. Secret first before Secret initiates with either the Lasso or the Chrono. Well, they may try, but Arteezy just being healed up now. Gandalf unveils his shiny new white staff. They get the swap off. It's into a roar. Arteezy isn't deep. They do finally manage to bring him down. That, that's, Perfect combination there. That's very well executed. They initiated first. And now like Navi are going to look to push the advantage here. Puppy being pursued out, but Envy is still there with the BKB. Doing quite a bit of damage. Can they focus Envy down? If not, he is going to turn this fight. He has stolen a lot of damage with the static link. Plus 226 there, it looks like. And now turning back and laying into art style. Bringing them all down on the courtesy of the Chrono with the buyback from Arteezy. They re-engage the era. Chasing. They've lost three. The buyback and another death. A dieback for him. Four heroes down for Navi, and in moments, likely a GG to come out. They are just out of out of horses at this point. They'll blink away with General, but they lack their carry. Arteezy, he gets the bash, insult to injury, the stomp, and then a couple more auto attacks will bring General down, and Dendi frantically moves in, but he gets purged. He gets focused down by the Void, bash after bash, crushing Navi spirits and crushing their chances of taking this game on. Secret and all the answers. They now lead the best of five, one to zero. Man, what a game by Secret Gorman. Man, absolute top class. Clinic. Solo. That was a clinic. Overall team play, excellent. Overall strategy, excellent. Itemization, great. Decision making, great. Like, Individual plays. Uh, they had it all.